Robert and Anna Strzok enjoyed their new Bangor Township home and the summer tradition that they started, backyard bonfires for their kids, Isaiah and Julia. But one night, something went terribly wrong. Isaiah was behind his dad. He wasn't even, he wasn't near the fire when it happened. From what I understand, gasoline is very combustible. And um, so it, it ended up to be a, a bad accident involving gasoline. And I turned around and my bright I hear my son saying, I'm on fire, Daddy. So I turn around and there's my son. You know, from his legs, he had on shorts and he had on a tank top. And uh, he was on fire. Every time you close your eyes, all you can see is hear, to hear your child screaming, Daddy, I'm on fire. Even though the Strucks lived just minutes from Bay Medical, paramedics raced Isaiah to Hurley, the regional burn center. Isaiah spent two weeks in Hurley's burn unit as the team of doctors, nurses, and therapists treated his second and third degree burns with both skill and compassion. This painful time was made a little easier thanks to Isaiah's parents who were with him around the clock, providing comfort and assistance. The Child Life Program was able to brighten Isaiah's day by providing toys and books, as well as soft blankets carefully made by volunteers. Through it all, Isaiah tried to be brave during some pretty difficult moments. It won't hurt. It's just going through your tube. The team in Hurley's burn unit not only took great care of Isaiah, but they were good medicine for his parents too. Once Isaiah was discharged, the Strzok family made weekly visits to Hurley's outpatient burn clinic. Lori Newton, the child life director, engaged Isaiah in what looked like playing, but was actually distraction therapy. This helped the dressing changes to go more easily. It was a big day when Isaiah was measured for his Jobst garments. It's gonna take a little bit, okay? So I gotta measure and see how big your leg is. Oh, cool. You ready? I'm so proud of you, Isaiah. Look how far you've come. But it doesn't hurt. You can touch it and everything. It doesn't hurt. See? I'm a miracle. He was measured for both pants and a glove. They were skin tight and played an important role in reducing the scarring from his burns. Thanks to his red and blue Jobst garments, this bubbly little boy pretends that he's a transformer. <gasps> Bumblebee! Transformers! <laughs> Isaiah has an amazing, resilient spirit. When you watch him now, it's hard to imagine that he had sustained such serious injuries. The Strzok family has learned a lot in this experience. Their deep faith in God has made all the difference. Without a doubt, Isaiah Strzok is truly a miracle. He's a young man who, despite some very trying times, uses positive spirit and sense of humor to inspire many of us across mid-Michigan. As a result, he walked away with a big prize, one that will help other children just like him. ABC 12's Mark Jacobson introduces us to this week's Big Kid. Isaiah Strzok has had quite the week. The seven-year-old from Bay City was declared the winner of Speedway's Battle of the Brave contest. I'm like really happy. I was like, yeah. Online votes made it happen. Many of those votes came from the staff at Hurley Children's Hospital in Flint. The same doctors and nurses that helped Isaiah heal from third-degree burns he received during a bonfire accident four years ago. Isaiah dropped by Hurley with his sister and Iron Man for a special celebration. Made me feel happy that some people care about 
about me. Isaiah's victory earned a $20,000 prize, which will be used to help kids just like himself in Hurley's pediatric burn unit. I was really excited since I was in seventh place and I went all the way to first. Isaiah and his sister passed out thank you notes to the staff. We love Hurley. Hurley, C M N H. Or miracles happen. And Isaiah, what do you want people to do? Call and vote for Pete. I see he's still in voting mode. We're done with the vote. He already won. What else do we want him to do? Please call and help make a donation. Like me. Without a doubt, Isaiah stole the show at the CMN Telethon. Not just with his pitch, but with his dance moves. Isaiah is dancing for dollars over here. Okay. <laughs> and now that he's Battle of the Brave champ, Isaiah Struck is this week's good kid and someone we're sure to see plenty of down the road. I get to be on TV and a superstar. Mark Jacobson, ABC 12 News.